Welcome to the Miami Heat Zone Podcast. I'm your host, Martel Llewellyn. We're pushing to 5,000 subscribers. Hit that subscribe button and thank you for all the support. So Nikola Jovic has successfully completed treatment for his foot. So our national team member, Nikola Jovic, recovered his foot injury with our team physiotherapist so he could be ready to join the team before the Olympic Games in Paris. We wish the whole team much success and health. Now, this doesn't necessarily mean that Jovic is going to play. Who really knows? At the end of the day, I'm glad that he's at least healthy. He's feeling better because I'm expecting a leap. He has to take a leap. We're going to need him to contribute extremely this year because think about it. If Bam Adebayo is going to continue to be our center, if Khalil Ware is not ready, that's where Jovic is going to have to step up. 6'11 frame, good handle for his size, good three-point shooter. I'm expecting to see more from his game. I know he's great in transition. I think he's an underrated passer, but especially with Jaime and Jovic, we're going to need to see a leap. Obviously, we're running it back. However, everyone's healthy for now. As long as we're able to see Jaime, Jovic, Terry, and everyone else contribute, this is going to be a very interesting Miami Heat team. Are, now, are we going to win a championship? I'm not saying that. But as long as I'm able to see the young guys ball out, as long as I'm able to see the vision that the Miami Heat have for Nikola Jovic, that's what matters to me. I want to see what's his potential really looking like because now he will have a full season ahead of him and he has this whole offseason to work on his game, get stronger, get faster, and really develop overall as a player. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. Like, share, comment, subscribe as we continue to push to 5,000 subscribers.